I get traditional support if I fight you, and reformer support if I back you. Your rite of passage tipped that balance, too. It's your choice, Grunt. Sounds like an easy job. That's the problem. I'm pure Krogan. Ulrich, you were the pretender. Your head is valuable, whether you're alive or dead. Just try to take it. You've been spotted. Oh, ah! Enemy charging! You'll flee! Oh, I feel like I'm cheating. Guys, get out of the way. Okay. <laughs> Yay. And now Grunt is a full adult Krogan. the rite of passage, earning the honor of clan and name. Many survive, but it has been years since a thresher maw fell. Your names shall live in glory. Grunt, you are Erdnacht. We now own property. Join the army and apply to serve under a battle master. Shepard is my battle master. She has no match. Understood. Congratulations, or not Grunt. Accept this token from Fortak. His weapons are the finest we have. What were you called before you became Shaman? I gave up my name when I became the Shaman. I am a conduit for the rage and bloodlust of my people. It would be wrong to retain my old identity. My life belongs to the clan. I want to know about Tichanka's past. Tuchanka is a place of great gifts. It kills the weak, torments the slow, and destroys the stupid. Survival is an honor, and here, Krogan thrive. We cover this planet with our civilization, only to burn it to the ground a dozen times over. Each time, we grow stronger. When we are wise and powerful enough, we will tame the planet forever. Oh my gosh, I don't, I don't get their philosophy, I just don't. <laughs> I've never heard anyone say that wiping out their own civilization was a good thing. I'd have thought you of all aliens would understand, Shepard. The Krogan empires and clans of the past were glorious, built in great battles and conquests, but their cores were weak. How else could they have fallen when Krogan civilization achieves its apex there will be no stopping it. No stopping us. Oh, lovely. No stopping the Krogan. He just came right out of his mouth. Tell me about Krogan rites and ceremonies. You have seen the rite of passage. Krogan suffer the rite of life at birth, and the rite of honor when they wish to be considered for breeding. The rite of firsts is suffered before a Krogan faces a new enemy. A clan leader also undergoes many rites in service to the clan. What rites did you go through to become Chief Shaman? Becoming the Shaman is excruciating. I passed through rites that made me wish to die. I carry the scars on my soul. I must perform rites each dawn and dusk to keep me bound into our Krogan nature. Our spirit is one of violence and death. 
I must be attuned to that. Your job is awful. Indeed. <laughs> I should go. May your foes be strong enough to keep you sharp. This might be useful. Yeah, no worries about the strength of our enemies. <laughs> Time to get the hell off of this planet. Killed the pressure mall on foot. Damn straight. You don't have the place. You hear that the tank bread and the human killed the pressure mall? Everybody's hurt. As if it does, it's Rex himself. Okay, I want to go this way, right? Yeah. Now, I mean, I'm gonna do one thing where I go. I'm gonna leave. Clan to Earth Knot has increased in strength after the destruction of Clan Warlock. In addition, killing the Thresher Maw has produced several breeding records. Oh, no, <laughs> no, you were supposed to say that. Okay, so it said. Numerous breeding requests for Grunt. And one for Shepard. <laughs> I found that hilarious when she's <laughs> Yeah, that's okay. I, I don't really want to even look at a Krogan, sorry. So it looks like I don't have to go back to Ch to Chanka. That's actually exactly why I wanted to go back. Was for what Edie says about the breeding requests. <laughs> All right, here we go. Now, now let's let's look. Journal, journal. Yes. Ha. Okay. So, we're actually going to get Garrus to talk. Yes! Maybe? Commander, you've received a new message oh. at your private terminal. Oh, this is the guy who um, got the military pep talk. <laughs> All right. Actually, wait. While I'm here, let me change Grunt's appearance. There we go. Alright. Now, let's see. How is our newest Turian crew member doing? His injuries looked painful. He's a soldier. It'll take a lot more than that to keep him down. There's something about him. I just want to hold him close and whisper, it will be all right. <laughs> oh man, what to say? Like, all of these. <laughs> I should have saved before this. <laughs> oh god, what to ever say? I can never ask this or, or later, like when Thane joins the group. This mission is too important to be plagued with drama, Yomo. Oh. I understand. Anyway, that, how may I help that, you, that didn't go how I wanted it to. <laughs> I thought it was going to be like a, here's a mod, bitch. I'll be here if you need anything. I should have saved before. I didn't think about that. Alright, but I'm going to go talk to you. Finally, we can talk to Garrus. I guess that it doesn't feel quite so long between the talks, um, as for you guys, like, as it was for me when I was first playing, because I was looking forward to talking to him all the time. So I felt even longer for me, because I was like... <sighs> Shepard, I'm glad.
glad you came by. I've got something. I may need your help. You remember Sidonis, the one who betrayed my team? I found a lead on him. There's a specialist on the Citadel, named Fade. He's an expert at helping people disappear. Sidonis was seen with him. What happened? How did Sidonis betray your team? He tipped off the mercs, told them where our base was. He drew me out with a false job, then let the mercs hit my team. My men weren't prepared. They tried to hold them off. By the time I got back, there were only two survivors. They didn't last long. All ten of them dead. Because of him. What are you planning to do when you find him? You humans have a saying. An eye for an eye, a life for a life. He owes me ten lives, and I plan to collect. <laughs> yep, good old Garrus. You sure that's how you want to play it? I'm sure. I don't need you to agree with me, but I'd like your help. Where do we find Fade? I've arranged a meeting. We'll meet him in a warehouse near the Neon Markets down on Zakara Ward. Thanks, Shepard. I appreciate you taking the time to help me. Yeah, no problem. I think while we're on the Citadel, we should buy you new armor. <laughs> oh, actually, I wonder if he has something else that he says about the mission. If Any chance we could get to the Citadel, Shepard? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'd like to follow that lead on Sidonis. Yeah, yeah. I'll let you know, Garrus. I'll be here if you need me. I thought maybe there was like a whole like different kind of conversation-y thing. I actually never tried to do that. Like, if, I think once I ended up um, asking someone something or another before we did their loyalty mission and they were like, can we go now? Can we go now? Come on. All right, I gotta go feed the fish. <laughs> Citadel. I forgot about this. There's actually another loyalty mission that's on the Citadel. Alright, let me go talk to Grunt because of his, you know, it's his after loyalty mission talk. Alright. Not grunt. I like it. I have a clan. That makes me... It makes me want to fight, not just able to. And Uvink, I wanted to disembowel him, to tear out his spine like a trophy. <laughs> we started this because you were losing control. Now you sound more violent than ever. Rex said I was normal. Just had this built-up stuff because of being grown in the tank. Now that I know it's not an outside thing, and I have a place as a Krogan, I like it. Our enemies are in trouble, Shepard, and we better not run out of targets. <laughs> oh, jeez. I'm not planning on living like this forever, Grunt. Talk like that, and it won't be your choice. I'm sure as hell not quitting with a whimper. Just so you're clear where we stand. Oh my goodness, Grunt. <laughs> Whoa, did she just like walk on the rail? Wait, let me see if I can do that again. No, okay, whatever, it doesn't matter. Alright, so I got a few things to do in the Citadel. I have to get fish, I have to get the cook's ingredients. And Garrus's side mission. I'm gonna do the quick stuff first, which would be buying the food stuff and the fish. And then we will start on Garrus's side mission. Jack would like to talk with you, Commander. I know she would. She's gonna have to wait until I'm more paragony. Why the hell?
tell that I start over there. I was most definitely on Tuchanka, not... I, <laughs> I actually said Tuchanka in the middle of a sentence. <laughs> but I can't let you board the shuttle with that. But this is a ceremonial item of my people. Sir, it's a 15 centimeter serrated blade. You humans are all racist. <laughs> I thought it might be nice to come back here and see how it's changed, but it's just like it was. Same dirty streets, same unrepentant scavengers, same revolving door prisons. Being security here is a terrible job. This is exactly why I left. Yeah. Sorry for the inconvenience, ma'am. Huh? What just happened? Sorry for the inconvenience, ma'am. Uh, yeah, you better open the fucking door for me. I'm saving. I don't want no glitches like that. That never happened. Like, as soon as that was over, that never happened to me again. And now it's happening again, and I'm just getting paranoid. Alright, so... Um... I think. Oh, oh, you know what? Else? Oh, ah, ha ha, ha ha, fish. This is the fish. And oh, I forgot about that. The space hamster. Yes. The space hamster. So I got my fish, and I'm getting my ship models. And now I'm exiting. <laughs> now this also... I don't know if we can do that yet, but there's another shop on the Citadel. I think this is... No, wait, this is I hear this it. is the best place for food on Zakara Ward. Oh, wait. You heard wrong. Uh -huh. This is the best place for food on the whole damn Citadel. Seriously, I don't see any point to that. Okay, so that's for the food. So now all I have left to do is Garrus's side mission, but there is another shot. Maybe it's not on this level. It must not be. I heard that those lakes up on the Presidium are filled with fish. <laughs> no, they're not. <laughs> you ever been up there? No. CSEC won't let me. They say I'm a risk. Uh, they <laughs> think every Krogan is dangerous. Damn Turians. We should kill them all. Oh, look who's standing right next to me, jackasses. Okay, so... <laughs> you know, it's funny that, um... 
he never reacts to anything they say and nor did Morden ever um, react to that whole Solarian comment um hold on oh what I wanted was the map um trying to decide which floor I want to go to I think I might want to go down to get to that that one shop I wonder what a presidium fish would taste like I'm telling you there are no fish up there So this is all you see of the Citadel. You do not go, I mean, well, you kind of saw the Presidium. You've kind of been there, but... No! No Japanese! Stop it! You weebos! Sorry, but that... Okay, <laughs> I thought I could climb up there, but I couldn't. This Calanthus is a thief, and I want her arrested. All right, it says shipping. I was just walking by. <gasps> no, this isn't it. Is it really on the other, 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 other? It, it has to be because I know it was a Turian who was the shopkeeper. It was like in a cornery area. I always go the opposite way that I want to go. Always. 